Hi there, let's go over your review questions for pulleys and mechanical advantage. Uh, just so you know, this is for our second scenario. First, let's find the mechanical advantage of the pulley system. What would the name be? It's called a block and tackle because it's got multiple pulleys. It's a block and tackle. Don't forget the MA is always, in any simple machine, the output force divided by the input force. So if the output force is 180 newtons and the input force is only 45 newtons, then we can find the MA. So 180 divided by 45 is 4. 4 what? 4 nothing. Mechanical advantage has no units. Now what if the box or this was 50 newtons? then how much would we be pulling with over here? A second way that you can find the MA of this, even though we know it's four, we already know it's four, is count the number of ropes that are holding up the load. Don't count a rope if you're pulling on it down. So one, two, three, there are four ropes helping hold up this load. So the MA is four. So what does that mean? If, we're lit, if the weight is 50 newtons and the MA is 4, the effort force would be 50 divided by 4, which is 12.5 newtons. So we'd only pull with 12.5 newtons. Uh, let's look at the next two. Find the MA and the effort force if it's a 100 newton load. So 100, 100 newtons and this one's 100 newtons. So let's do this one. Uh, we don't know the uh, we know the output, but we don't don't know our input force. So we cannot use M A equals output over input. We can't use that. So we'll have to use the number of ropes trick. One rope holding up, two, three, four ropes. This one does not count. So the M A is four. Okay, so now let's use this. So if the MA is 4 and the output is 100 newtons, we can find the input or the effort force. So let's times both sides by effort force. That's 1 times this by effort force. Let's divide by 4 by both sides. That's 1. So effort force equals 100 newtons divided by 4. So what does that equal? 25 newtons. So we pull with 25 newtons on the rope to lift that. Uh, next one. Let's see. Here's our effort. Here's our load. Or another name for effort is your input force. And this is your output force. So MA equals output divided by the input. Um, we know the output, but we don't know the input, so we can't use this yet. So let's use the number of ropes. We have one, two ropes hold, helping hold up the load. This rope doesn't count because we're pulling on it down. So the MA is two. Okay, so MA is two. Output is 100 newtons, and we don't know the input or sometimes that's called the effort force. Okay, let's times both sides by effort force and times this side by effort force. Let's divide both sides by two. Let's tidy it up. Effort force equals 100 newtons divided by two, so that would be 50. So you pull with 50 newtons to lift something that's 100 newtons. So that's a simple uh, worksheet on pulleys and mechanical advantage.